30 years ago today, we were both five. Living life to the full, feeling so happy to be alive. We both had a full head of air, but who'd have known back then it wouldn't always be there. 20 years ago today, we would have both been 15. Getting into all sorts of experiences, I'm sure you know what I mean. Hating school, liking girls, loving sleep, had a bad attitude, but still loving life, and hey, we were never rude. 10 years ago today, we was mid-twenties, all grown up. Now at the stage that we home each other's favorite coffee cup. We've now got chores to do, kids to feed, cars to fix, bills to pay. We didn't mind now, as long as we could still have our chats, everything was okay. One year ago today, we were both 34. Been through a lot of good and bad times now, but looking forward to a lot more. Not one of us yet a millionaire like we discussed, but hey, we were still best friends, so we wasn't really fussed. Three months ago today, we were about 35. I'm still struggling to accept that it's only me who is alive. For it was only three months ago today, my lifelong friend seemed to have lost his way. Three months ago today, our worlds would dramatically change. Not having us anymore feels very, very strange. We will always help each other and neither of us were ever far away. So why, oh why, could I help you geez three months ago today? What do they mean that the pain will get easier every day? I've never known this pain before, but it's got worse from three months today. Since you've been gone, I've only had one dream about you. It was the best dream ever, us together doing what we do. I was so sad in the morning when I laid there awake, facing another day without you, unsure how many more I can take. One year ago from today, I'll be 36. Still thinking how you not being here was something I just couldn't fix. Hoping this pain has now gone, coming to terms with losing my number one. Ten years from today, I'll be mid-forties and my kids will all be grown up. Would I have stopped thinking about you, geez? Would I still be drinking from your favourite coffee cup? Twenty years from today, I'll be fifty-five. My kids now looking after me, I hope. Sure I'll still be telling them all our stories. Sure I'd have learned now how to cope. 30 years from today, I'll be 65. Hopefully retired like we spoke about. I'll probably always be visiting your gravestone keys just to get me out. 40 years from today, I'll maybe now have reached 75. I'll now be looking forward to seeing you again when my time's up. Not long now, geez, we'll be chatting, laughing again, drinking from our favourite coffee cup. Geez, I'm not sure why I keep writing about you. It just somehow at the moment helps me through. Thinking about you never being again here, writing it down helps me better than shedding a tear. I'm trying to get happy again now, geez. I'm trying to do the things we used to do. Three months ago today, something died in all of us. We'll never forget, we'll never lose sadness, we'll never stop missing you. But now for me, no more sadness from today. I'm just going to remember all our many good times. Think about our childhood and how we used to laugh and play. And no more thinking what rhymes. Our grown up times giggling together and taking the mic, us together and feeling complete for once. People say to me that you is like a brother to me, geez. Well, that's not true. I've got three of those who are amazing in their own unique way. What me and you had was just us, nothing more, nothing less. It was a unique bond which I'll carry me with me for the rest of my life. You were my happiness for my first 35 years, geez, and your inspiration will be my happiness for the next.